very lucky, even though she's here in the Bay Area, it's still very hard uh, to, to get Angela. And uh, for those of you who might have signed up early for this event, uh, we actually had her for last week and we had to reschedule for this one uh, because the White House needed her uh, at an event last week during that time. And she had to pick and choose. I, was, it, was it a difficult decision? I, no, she's shaking her head no. <laughs> So um, anyway, so um, one of her uh, first efforts was to, uh, uh, to found the Urban Strategies Council based in Oakland that many of you may know. Uh, a great group that we've done some work with, uh, worked to lift up communities out of poverty, engage communities and, uh, and, and residents in really making their areas into uh, vibrant, healthy communities. Um, she uh, then was a partner at Public Advocates, uh, which really tries to use the courts and increasingly policy uh, to fight for the rights uh, of underrepresented uh, communities. And uh, during that time, really led some of their efforts on developing innovative non-litigation strategies. And I just have to say, Public Advocates has become a, a wonderful partner of Transforms lately, um, doing more and more work at the intersection of transportation and land use at the regional and state scale with us. And for those of you who aren't here, and, and unfortunately part of the we had to have a lot of people not here, including many of our staff, because there's a big hearing tonight on Plan Bay Area, and uh, which is our sustainable community strategy for the region. And um, Transform Public Advocates and Urban Habitat um, are attributed with the fifth alternative, uh, known as the Environment, Equity, and Jobs Alternative, in this scenario, where they kind of combined our ideas um, and, and lifted it up as one of the things studied. And guess what? When you combine strong equity strong kind of transit environmental agenda with affordable housing and high opportunity areas, what do you get? You get the environmentally superior alternative. Uh, and that's what it is called. Um, unfortunately, they're not required to adopt the environmentally superior alternative. That takes politics. And so um, we're, that's why a lot of our staff are actually there tonight instead of here. Um, and so, um, so we're doing great work uh, uh, with public advocates. And after uh, Many years at the Rockefeller Foundation, uh, Angela in 99 started PolicyLink. Um, I think most of you are familiar uh, with their work, but they're really a national organization lifting up great policies, uh, spreading them around the country, um, and that's where we've gotten to know each other and have our organizations work together. Uh, we have been fortunate enough to have PolicyLink as a member of Transform's board for the last seven years, and so when ideas come in, like, Marin County had a really successful Safe Routes to Schools program, and we were saying, why don't we bring it in here? Um, having Policy Link's voice in our boardroom says, yeah, well, let's do it here, but let's focus in on disadvantaged communities. As and, you know, we see the Marin models working, but that's one thing. Um, and can we make it work here in Oakland? Um, and so, bringing that voice into everything we've done, and, and now there's actually a lot of work happening at the state level, um, uh, where Policy Link is increasingly engaged. Um, so, uh, really, when, when I look around at the social justice field, you end up seeing Angela's fingerprints all over it. Um, and so, uh, and, and she's, she at Policy Link and the groups that she's worked with have had a big influence on how um, many of us in here and certainly Transform approach our work. Really looking for those things, there's not that many of them all the time, but enough of these huge win-win solutions for equity, the environment, and kind of an economy that perhaps with all that, we really can, um, you know, determine to join together and, and focus on those solutions. Um, so, uh, I think we're going to get, um, for those of you who haven't seen Angela, uh, some real inspiration tonight. So I'm going to stop talking. And I